Sports Sign. Starting the season undefeated at home, the Lady Lions had their sights focused on their first road game of the season, a trip to Knoxville, Tennessee against the Lady Vols. Going into another team's gym, there's always going to be a lot of fans against you. They got a lot of people in there yelling, it's going to be loud. For the freshmen, it would be their first taste of Division I basketball in a hostile environment. A lot of times you go in there and it's just you, a few people's parents, your coaches, your teammates, and that's all you got in there. It's us, so we got to communicate. We got to be loud. We got to encourage each other. Let's go. Have a lot of energy. Get hype. It's okay. Let's go. Let's go. Baby, it's okay. One, two, three. For one veteran lady lion, it was a special opportunity to connect with family and play at her dad's alma mater. He played at Tennessee from 92 to 95, so I actually talked to him today. He was saying it's going to be weird, you know, not cheering for Tennessee when he goes into Thompson Bowling, but um, he will be in attendance and he will be cheering for us. <laughs> well, I just basically told her, you know, to have a, have a good time. Just play the game and, uh, you know, do what you do. Uh, take care of your assignments. Uh, if anything happens outside of that, it just happens. Um, one thing you can control is how well you play defense and rebound. But she's doing a, a good job of uh, maintaining that, uh, that approach in terms of rebounding and uh, defending. Uh, now it's just a matter of uh, continuing to grow as an offensive player and get better. The Lady Lions gave the fourth rank Lady Vols all they could handle. In a close contest, Peyton led the way with inspired play on both sides of the floor. I remember coming out of college and, you know, having her, and then now to stand in here tonight and to see her play in college, I mean, it was really a special feeling and, you know, a lot of excitement. Peyton's performance earned her a spot on the Big Ten honor roll for the week of November 23rd. Her success on the court this season is due in part to her hard work over the summer. Peyton has gotten off to a great start this year and I'm really happy for her. She, she put in a lot of work in the off season. Uh, I think she's feeling a lot more confident about how she can play, a lot more confident about the way she can contribute and that confidence is helping her be uh, quite a force for us on both ends of the floor. Co has just been really big on just me with my role is um, just filling the stat sheet, you know, creating for others and getting rebounds, offensive rebounds, you know, scoring in transition and just little things like that. Um, so that's why she said it's been my best basketball because um, I'm actually doing what she was expected of me to do. For veterans and newcomers alike, Coquise has high expectations of her team this season. The three-time Big Ten Coach of the Year will have the Lady Lions playing together all for one.